Uh, hopefully getting ready to go, but if you can't hear me, I don't know if you'll know if you turn it on. I think Carl turns the, the camera on, and then, but I don't know if you can hear me. Carl, please. Mr. Ramick? Here. Mrs. Winton? Here. Ms. Croft is excused tonight. Uh, Mr. Johnson? Here. Mr. Rosera? Here. Ms. Pat? Here. Mr. Woolley? Here. Mayor Sollers? Here. Mrs. Bauer? Here. Mrs. Toko? Here. Councilman Bazzaro, would you like to leave us in the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible. And number three, can I have an acceptance of the agenda? Motion. Support. Yeah, I have a motion by Councilman Remick, supported by Councilwoman Witten. <laughs> All those in favor say yes. Yes. All opposed say no. Number four, can I have an acceptance of the motion to approve acceptance of the minutes, the motion to approve the acceptance of the minutes to of the meeting held December 15, 2020, and dispense with the oral reading. Motion. Support. I have a motion by Councilwoman Pat, supported by Councilwoman Winton. Is there any discussion? If not, all those in favor say yes. Yes. All opposed say no. Motion carries. Now it takes us to the mayor communications part of the agenda. Mayor Sellers, do you have anything tonight? Okay. So that moves us to the regular part of the agenda. And item 6.1 is a motion to approve payment to Western Wayne County Fire Department for hazmat cleanup in the amount of $5,567. This is funded through General Fund Fire Department to Contractual Services Account. Motion. Support. I have a motion by Councilman Remick, supported by Councilman Bazura. Is there any discussion? I wonder if I could ask sure. the... Sure. No. Just a quick question, sir. Good evening to the chair, to the council. Oh, yeah, Chief, on. just a quick question. When we have a hazmat cleanup done and we pay for it, is this a com combination of payments from all of us to the, um, the other departments that pay for or was this just for us? This was just for us, sir. Okay. What this was, was this was an accident. We had a spill of diesel fuel that was starting to get into the sewer system, things of that nature, and the cleanup was there. We called out the Down River Hazmat team to assist us on that, and they charge us directly as the city slash fire department. We do our own cost recovery, and then we bill out to the insurance company from there. That's exactly what I was gonna, thank you very much. So we do bill the insurance company? Yes, sir, okay. and we build in our services on top of what this charge is plus okay. our charges. Yeah. Through the chair, uh, where was this at again? Um, to tell you the truth, I want to say it was a telegraph and Goddard, but off the top of my head, I'm not 100% sure. I'm looking at the report myself, looking at it, and it'll keep saying telegraph, telegraph, telegraph. Right. Yes. It was a telegraph and Goddard. Thank you, Mayor. Through the chair, was it a, a truck? diesel carrying truck or was it an accident? I was not on the scene, sir. I was just going off the paperwork there, but it was a car accident with okay. the vehicle leaking diesel fuel down into the stream system okay. sewer system. I just didn't know if it was a tanker. No, I couldn't tell you that. I didn't look for you thoroughly enough. Okay. Any other questions? Thank you, Chief. You're welcome. Thank you. If not, all those in favor say yes. 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 All opposed say no. Motion carries. Item 6.2 is a motion to approve January 2021 payroll in the appropriate amount of $1,927,000. Make a motion. Support. Yeah, I have a motion by Councilman Johnson, supported by Councilwoman Winton. Is there any discussion? If not, all those in favor say yes. Yes. All opposed say no. Motion carries. 
6.3 is a motion to approve the November 3rd, 2020 general election coding by Dominion Voting Systems, Inc., state vendor, in the amount not to exceed $3,235, and this is funded through General Fund City Clerk's Office Election Supply. Motion. Support. Yeah, I have a motion by Councilwoman Pat, supported by Councilman Johnson. Is there any discussion? If not, all those in favor say yes. Yes. All opposed say no. Motion carries. Item 6.4 is a motion to approve payment in the amount of $8,350 to the National Faith Home Buyers for Down Payment Assistance for Home Buyer Number 2020-031. And this is funded through the Home Grant. Motion. Support. I have a motion by Councilman Remick, supported by Councilwoman Pats. Is there any discussion? If not, all those in favor say yes. Yes. All opposed say no. Motion carries. Item 6.5 is a motion to receive and file Winterfest invoices in the amount of $103,125. The invoices paid from Winterfest proceeds and sponsorship. Motion. Support. Yeah, I have a motion by Councilwoman Winton, supported by Councilman Bazura. Is there any discussion? Uh, Mr. Chair, I do have a question for Councilman I know we, uh, through the chair, we, uh, we uh, received an email in regards to this prior to this, um, and I had some questions for you, Guido, and you did answer them. Um, I did have a couple other ones. Um, some of the, the uh, invoices were had costumes on there. So are those costumes ours to keep? Or was that something that went through the Detroit Circus or? Um, uh, through the chair council, good evening. Um, to answer the question, that'd be uh, Carol Ann Clowns. So the costumes would be for the uh, characters, the themed characters. We would not be in possession of those. She just gives very itemized invoices, but those are the characters that we requested and, and they, they brought them to life through those costumes. Okay, so it was their people that did the? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I didn't know if it was some somebody that we had. Um, and is there anything that is, um, Non, non-consumable um, that we are keeping out of all of this, or is this just? I know we're paying out to other companies, but is there anything in here that we're, you know, like Amazon and things like that? So. Uh, yeah, if there's anything left over, uh, like the Fun Express, Amazon, those were for different themed weekends, so they could have been milk bones for the dogs. Um, so we wouldn't retain those, obviously. <laughs> uh, little giveaways, little stuffed animals, uh, Christmas themed rubber ducks, the list little things that we were giving to each person who would attend the event down the Santa shoot. Um, the scrim would be, uh, we keep that for all events, future events, things of that nature. Um, that would go on the fencing where you see it scrimmed off. Uh, lasting impressions is also little giveaways. They were just different things that we could get from those vendors for the themed weekends. Okay. We know this is the last weekend. There's still another weekend available for Correct. people to go. Yeah, okay. if, if anyone wants to attend, it is Harry Potter themed weekend. So the Harry Potter characters will be there. The digital board is set up with Harry Potter. Um, so kind of cool if you're into Harry Potter, we'd love